How do villains in today? I have a huge box, massive. Postman was sweating. This is from Stephen Lester. Stephen Cutter. Stephen a jigsaw. Or some broken glass. Stephen Lester sent me this. He said, Phil, I have a huge box. Would you like it? The box is stuff. It's all to get lost. So yes, please. Uh, and they sent it in the post. It's brilliant. And the postage is told me to donate to uh, the Brain Trust. So I'm going to donate this postage to the Brain Trust, which is fantastic. So I've no idea what's in it. All I know is it's flipping heavy. Listen to that. So I've got my Swiss Army knife. Uh, and then we'll get into the tape and then we'll see what's in it. So stay there. Shall we play the bod music because they're not played in ages? Yes, let's play it now. <laughs> Stop the clock! What's in it? Hey! Weird computer games! <laughs> Look at that! For those that didn't watch my channel just the other day, I had a... Uh, I had a, uh, what was the one I had? Was, uh, was it the horror one? Say there. This is it. That's what I was talking about. I was asking if anybody uh, knows any more about these. Now I have another. Weird computer games. Let's have a look what games are in it. Tower of Terror. Skulls. Of the pyramid, monster with uh, monster wrestling, jaws, flying witches, uh, micro puzzle, answers to puzzle. That is fantastic. I uh, hope the games arrive okay. Enjoy the box too. Keep up the excellent work and enjoy the game, Stephen. <laughs> Specky Nation. I got that one. Was it did mention on that envelope? That I've got that one, but I've not got that one. I'm getting close to uh one, we're getting close to 1,700 subscribers. That will be a part of a giveaway. But speculation, I've not got that one. I've definitely got that one. Part of a giveaway. Speculation. That is brilliant. What else have we got here? Flipping heck. Sweet pea. Look at that. Right. Oh my word. Untouchables. From Ocean. I played Dying Hazes. Wasn't there a pram level on this? Where well, there's a pram, because you know, there's a famous scene where like Elliot Ness is in a train station. And the pram's going downstairs. I'm sure there's a pram level. Positive risk. Untouchables. Ghostbusters 2. That done by the Oliver Twins, if I remember rightly. Positive risk. Ghostbusters 2. Back to the Future 3. Uh, 2, sorry. Not 3. 
we'll have to stack these up. Robocop 2! God. No wonder it was so heavy. Bubble Bubble Hit Squad. Oh, Master Triton. Vegas Jackpot. Rouge. <laughs> Rogue. Another Master Triton. Flippy Flip. Abstract. Master Spectrum. Founder Boing I'm a crap at Bounder. I'm truly crap at Bounder. ATV simulator. I've got that. I've got that. That that can go as a giveaway as well. Well part of the book. That's one of those bloody budgies that can get you on that level. Got that. That's part of the 1700. Split personalities. Sweet Pete. Tempest. Mastertronic or well, Ricochet. Mastertronics are available. That pile is getting bigger. Oh, classic adventure. Classic adventure from Melbourne House. I don't think I've ever played that. Night time. I think I've only got Spellbone and Finders Keepers. So that'll go well. Mastertronics 1 to 8. Chucky Egg! Upsetting to know, but I haven't got Chucky Egg. I've played it so many times. Screenshot shots from the Amiga version. Isn't that strange? Chucky Egg, look. Screenshots from Amiga version. I don't know if you can see that. That is weird. I think we're being more famous on like on the Spectrum or the BBC version. Who would have picked on that? Sweevo's World! Now I do have that, so I shall stick that on the pile for giveaways. What else is in here? BMX Ninja. I remember playing that as a kid. BMX Ninja. From Alternative Software. Didn't they release School Days at one point? <laughs> else is in here? Elevator Action. I don't think I've ever played that one. Who's that from? Bug Bite. Oh, so it looks like a, it's an arcade release. Yeah, based on the arcade. A coin up. Rasta scam. I remember that. That's a master joint one. Rasta scam, yeah, I remember that. Impressive graphics in that. My god, look at that pile of games. Automania from Microgen, part of the Wally series. Down there! Hey! That was corky though. All the Down there games were good, weren't they, if I remember rightly? Grid Runner. That is a cracking game. From Quicksilver. That is cracking. Or imagine stopping curse. <laughs> I, I haven't played that since perhaps its release, to be honest with you. What's that? When was it released? 1983. My god. 
My friend had that on his computer. When we all got our spectrums, he had that. That's getting ready to Jenga. I better be careful there. Roll the coaster! From Elite. Mm -mm -mm. A crash smash, no less. Oh my god. Weetabix. I always wanted this as a kid. And I hated Weetabix. I hated Weetabix, but I always wanted that. Versus the titches. If I remember rightly, it wasn't just like a Space Invaders game. Positive it is. One of the Weetabixes. Weren't they like a, like a skinhead sort of character? Wasn't it him like the skinhead sort of character? Like a bother boots on and stuff like that. Also, Ocean's Kong. <laughs> that is a big pile of games. Oh, Mastertronica did I mention Strike? Not the uh, comic strip event, the comic strip one Strike, but Bowling. Daily Thompson Decathlon, that was the only game my mum would ever play on the spectrum, Daily Thompson Decathlon. My mum used to always say she could have gone to the Olympics, but instead she had me instead, because she was a top athlete. How's that for guilt trip when you're a kid? She'd only ever play that on the spectrum, that. She used to come upstairs and say, Put Daily Thompson's on, and the night she wasn't watching uh, Coronation Street, Chubby Gristle. From Bug Bite. <laughs> I haven't seen that in years, Chubby Gristle. I even forgot that existed. <laughs> Do have ant attack, so that can go in the pile of giveaways as well. So what's that up to? Four things in the pile of giveaways: a book and three games so far. Ninja Entertainment USA. It looks like Mastertronic. Perhaps it is. Perhaps it's another Mastertronic label. The graphics ring the bell. Yeah, that's definitely Mastertronic. Oh, there's a Mastertronic one. The Empire Fights Back. Hang on a minute. No, it's not what I thought it was. But it's a Mastertronic one, and I do like my Mastertronic games. Let's close that up. I've knackered that up now. Oh, 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 oh. I knackered the case. Mastertronic. My saving grace when I was a kid, Mastertronic. Because I got a sod old pocket money. There's a shop near me that sold nearly every Mastertronic game in the world. Oh, another Master Trunny one, Delta Wing. That was quite good. It's a bit like Mercenary. Delta Wing. Look at the case. It's red. I know red's not exciting to most people, but it's different. Fighting Warrior. I remember that. Got weird lizard people in it, hasn't it? Fighting Warrior from Melbourne House. Wow, I've just seen something brilliant. Costa Panyans. 
or Panyai, Panyai's, can't remember, pronounce his name. Android 2. That is an amazing game. I can't honestly ever recall seeing the cover art for that. That is some amazing cover art. Two more games to go. M -m 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 mask from Bite Back. Should have played that on my 80s playthrough, shouldn't I? Have to quickly go back and play it. Does look a bit pant. Definitely have to go and play it. Last one. Grand Prix Simulator from Codemasters. S signed off by Johnny Dumfries. Is it Johnny Dumfries? Yeah. I can't remember did Johnny Dumfries. <laughs> And I used to watch Formula One around that time, so. so I don't know who Johnny Dumfries is. Sorry, Johnny. I don't know. I'm positive I've got that. I'll have to look. If I've got that, that's in the pile. If I've not got that, it's in my pile. So, that is an outstanding amount of games. Thanks to Stephen. Also, I've got. Uh, another Osborne computer book and a Specky Nation and thanks to Stephen so let me put that there carefully don't want to knock my Jenga tower we've now got something for 1,700 subscribers giveaway uh, I'm going to throw some sweets into we've got ATV Three Rose World Ant Attack and Speculation Volume 2. And I thought it was sweet. Anyway. That is brilliant. Whoa. They dropped them all in. Thank you, Stephen Wester. That is outstanding. I'm now, <laughs> before uh, life gets on, <laughs> got to find somewhere to put all of them. <laughs> I've already occupied. Uh, Quite a bit of space. Anyway, I'm going to do it. But I'm off. It's brilliant. I'm made up. I'm truly made up. Thank you very much. Have a great day. TTF and everybody. Ta ta for now. Cheerio. Bye bye. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. <laughs> I <ain't no> <laughs>